guys, Lego Prime Films here, and this is my Lego Jetwing Optimus Prime from Dark of the Moon. So yeah, this guy looks really cool, and yeah, he can still transform. I just hooked the jet wings on right now because it's kind of a pain to do, but I'll explain how I did it. There's a view from the front. View from the side and I'll show you a view from the back so he has to be on the stand unfortunately for to it to be able to wear the jet wings but I think I wouldn't want to storm just standing it up anyway this looks way cooler because otherwise it rips off his back that's why I have a stand for both I have this at an angle so his legs are more poseable it looks like he's flying off the ground or whatever you can see right here is where the stand is but yeah, this guy is really cool. I got this done in like five or six hours. And I did give him a new, a couple of updates too to allow him to be more sturdier. Uh, in truck mode, first of all, he does have a tabbing joint down there, which I actually fixed a while back, but I changed it again. And he has a new chest thing too, which actually makes the truck mode look a little more cleaner, I think. So yeah. I mean, he looks much better. And now he looks insanely cool with these jet wings on. He's buying many figures to show how big he is. Look, this guy's actually really big. It's kind of hard to see. You just need to see him in real life and see how cool he is. Here he is by Studio Series Optimus Prime. And yeah, I mean, not much to talk about this guy. Unfortunately, I don't have his weapons built yet. I'm going to be getting more Lego pieces soon, though. And that is one of the things that I definitely plan on doing first. Is the weapons. And there's a couple other people, too. I got a request to build Stinger, so I'll build him. And I also promised you guys I'd build Bumblebee, like, two years ago. So I'll do that also. So, yeah. I mean, that's basically it for this video. For the stand here, this is not actually hooked on to anything. It's just sitting in there in a special position. This is holding it at the angle with these slope pieces in the back. And this is very sturdy. Like, I pressed down with my hand and it didn't go anywhere. So it's fine. And back here, there's, like, a lot of pieces fit together and rigged up. But it works, like, really well. This is also incredibly sturdy. So yeah, that's nice. And I made it white because the backdrop is white. Hopefully he's easier to see. If I had blue or red or even more gray than I do now, then he'd sort of blend in with it. But anyway, yeah, that's basically it for this video. Thanks for watching, guys.